Hello everyone, I'm here with the, my goodness, the champion, the number one dealer for Salad Master in 2020, Diamond Elite, Miss Tina Lindres. Good hello, evening. Hello, hello. And I'm here to ask you some questions we don't normally ask. So oh, wow. just for fun, <laughs> secret talent. Shit. My brain <laughs> is as foggy. Secret talent. Because of the snorkeling? <laughs> I can't even, I don't know what says it's Secret about. talent. Something we don't know about you. Yeah. I have no talent. Oh my goodness, Tina. You have so much you talent. Be the number one dealer. Yeah, you can't be the number one without a talent. Okay, okay, Come pass, on. Pass, pass, oh my god, biggest question. fear. Oh. Biggest, biggest fear. fear. Well, losing family. Yeah. What makes you mad? Excuses. Who is your hero? <laughs> I love, uh, I think Barack Obama is. Okay. Best place you've been to? This way. Just one. Oh, la, la. Most expensive thing you bought for yourself? <laughs> Jewelry. Maybe? Jewelry. And for someone else? Okay, okay. Well, I don't know. Your, Jewelry. Office, your office building. Yeah. Your office is building. I'm not making sex. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Ayo. <laughs> uh, here's the president guiding her. <laughs> yeah, yeah, rescuing me. Rescuing. I love it. Yeah. Um, most expensive thing you bought for someone else? For Emma, maybe? <laughs> Jewelry. Jewelry, too. What will you tell your 20 year old self? I love to hear this. Well, the, the the things that you do now, the decisions that you make now matters. Okay. No, nothing that you do is irrelevant. Okay. Your greatest achievement, Tina? Being a mother. Three and running a successful organization, combining and balancing both. Yeah, true. Three words to describe yourself. Fierce, passionate, kind. Yeah, and beautiful. I'll well, add one. That's your word. Message to someone who wants to be a millionaire, Tina. You have to understand what first what it takes to be one. And you should be willing to pay the price. Yeah. Tina, you know, in the Philippines, we normally have this, um, the bus, and they always ask some questions at the end. Is it okay if I ask you sure. that? Sure. Sex or chocolate? Chocolate. <laughs> lights on or lights off? Uh, lights off. Okay. That's it. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So you have to listen what she has to say to us. Uh, life only gets better from here. You know, whatever, uh, whatever position or whatever situation you are in, always remember that life only gets better from here. If you're feeling down, if you're feeling desolate, if you're feeling frustrated, it only gets better. So don't give up. Don't give up on your hope on your faith don't give up on your dreams no matter what the circumstances are always always just remember it gets better than this if, especially if you start doing the right thing Tina what what do you think um, what was your mindset when the pandemic happened when it was first um, happened March I think last year what was your mindset well knee-jerk reaction was um, a little bit confused and then s second, and I think the most important one, was having a mindset that life only gets better from mm -hmm. here and asking yourself the right questions. What do you do now? And then when you ask yourself the right questions, you know, your brain Googles the right answer. So these are the things that you must do. You know, the answers could be different. For me, it was different. I just took it, you know, I took that answer seriously and took uh, took it, everything to the next level. I was very, very excited to be quite honest. During those times yeah. when everyone was confused no, and no, like I was want very, to quit, no, you no, were I so was, excited. I was excited because of the possibilities of what could happen if we tap into something unknown. Ah, so you're if, excited about possibilities. Exactly. Ah, that's good. Different because mindset. I always, I always see there's always, you know, something beneath this bubble and that's what I saw as they say there's always an opportunity amidst adversity so you do believe in that oh absolutely what do you think uh, makes you different I mean Diamond Elite only two of you Glory and you made it to the uh, Diamond Elite there's nothing I think that made us different 
I think uh, there was a, a certain sense of luck. No, I'm not going to call it luck, but there is a, a, a very, very strong team behind us who latch on to what we said we're going to do and also to get to the next level. Otherwise, we won't be here. But great leadership. You are such uh, an excellent leader, I think. Because you need to have a good leader during those times. Otherwise, people don't know who, who, what to do and who to follow. I don't know if it was great leadership. I would say it's great team. Great team. Well, I, I think differently. Okay. Great team needs to be a, have a great deal, a great, great leader. Well, I think otherwise. I think you start with a great team and the team builds you to become the leader the great that leader. you should be. Oh my gosh. Message to someone who wants to be successful in this business, to be Diamond Elite. Like you? Uh, <laughs> like me. Message to me. <laughs> I'm a message to you is you're doing great. Do the same thing, but just double and triple your efforts if you doubt your results. Okay. Thank you. I need that. <laughs> Thank you, Tina. And say bye to everyone. Hello, bye. Hello. And you, uh, your office is in? Oh, the coldest part of Canada. Winnipeg. Winnipeg, Winnipeg Canada. Thank you, Tina. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Bye.